today we are doing another deep dive on some seriously undervalued cards. Now these are the trainer gallery cards from Silver Tempest. Every time I do a deep dive on any trainer gallery, I always see tons of cards that are really beautiful and really undervalued. We're just going to jump straight into it. Obviously, you guys can see all of the cards right here. We're going to dive into some individuals. We're not going to be really touching on some of these cards that have seen huge price jumps. We're going to touch on a lot of the undervalued, underrated cards. Now, these are from Silver Tempest, so I think it's important to look at the box price. So right now, these boxes are around 160 bucks, but some of them have been selling a little bit under. Call it We can call it 150-ish, 160-ish, right? So what does that mean for you? Once this these box prices continue to rise, okay, the card values are going to go with them, especially some of these lower cards. Imagine when this is a $300 box. Okay. Now, first up, we have the Ray the Rayquaza, Rayquaza, however you would want to pronounce it, at a four dollar card. Like, are you guys serious? These uh, gold cards are slapped on, in my opinion. Okay, legendary Pokemon. These cards look really great in person. Now, if you want to pick this up raw, you can get it for about five bucks on TCG Player. I also like to talk about the PSA 10 values because I do think that is relevant. So if you wanted to pick up a PSA 10 right now, you can get this for 40 bucks or best offer. So probably cheaper, probably maybe even around 35 on eBay. So uh, just keep that in mind that PSA 10 prices are, uh, I always consider that a factor of what you can pick up now because sometimes grading fees can be 20 bucks or more depending on your tier level and all of that stuff. So if you're going to spend 20, you might as well, you could spend 40 right here and already have it in a 10. So super undervalued. Like how, how could this card not be... 80 in a 10, right? At least. So you're doubling your money, potentially. You can get another one down here. Yeah, I mean, like, there's more available. Then let's talk about the Blissey. The Blissey, this is a great uh, artwork. And we got the trainer in here, the black border. You guys were telling me in some of the past videos, uh, yellow border, yellow border. I, and I get it. I get it. And you guys are right. The black borders look, be look better. $4.70 all day on TCG Player, right? So $5 card. If you guys look at this, could you not see that this could be a $10 card? I could see it, right? Raw? So that would be doubling your money, right? This is there's potential down the road once the, the box the boxes do their thing, you know, a few, a few more years potentially. You never know how quickly it's going to happen, but uh, let's take a look at a PSA 10 price. This is the cheapest one I could find on eBay currently, 55 bucks in a 10. Yeah, I could same thing, like... This could be between 80 and 110, potentially at least 80 ish. Not so, maybe not as much upside because this isn't as cheap on eBay right now. But if you're getting it raw, right, for five bucks and grading yourself, then that makes a lot more sense for this particular card. Then you got the, the Zorora. Like, look at this. Look at this artwork. This is a great looking card. And you know, this card's seen, seen a little bit of an increase right now. If you pull up these last solds, you know around five or six bucks uh, same thing like couldn't this be a ten dollar card i think it could you just look at it cool pokemon great artwork um then you want to get it in a 10 look at this look at this 30 bucks for a 10 like are you guys kidding me so this one is like i would just pick it up in a 10 personally because that's kind of a no-brainer all right then uh corviknight so this Pokemon is uh, in the new Pokemon Horizons, the anime. So one of the dudes has one that he rides. So some popularity that kids are gonna kids are gonna think he's cool, and he's pretty cool looking, honestly. I like this uh, this artwork actually, and it connects with the V card, which you'll see in a second. But this is a V Max, right? And this is three bucks, three bucks all day long. So once once again, same thing. You, I could see this being a. 10 12 dollar card 15 dollar card right so then what are you 5xing your money at 15 dollars potentially down the road so this is us trying to get way ahead on some of these plays but i think that these cards these trainer galleries are too good honestly if you want to pick it up in a 10 you're looking at only 33 bucks currently as of this recording this is uh canadian this is us so 33 dollars or best offer so you might even be able to get it for cheaper which is insane and so this connects with the v card because you can see here he's got his little cable car he's the dude's getting in the corvinite's looking cool um so right and then same price on this card it's like four bucks so 
you know, if the other one's maybe 12 to 15, this could be 8 to 10, so you're still, if you're buying a bunch of these cards, you've still got a lot of potential upside. So the Corvin IV, I love the artwork. Great looking cards, just when you when you just look at them and analyze them, right? Uh, if you want to pick this up in a 10, same thing. 30 bucks on eBay, right? All day. So there is that. Then I did want to touch on this card, and we'll go back to the main page and look at all of them. But yellow border, okay. But look at this, look at this cardivore. Like just look at this, like this artwork. And okay, this is what's insane to me. Near mint, fifty nine cents. Like look at these last holds. Eighty nine. Okay, a few that were at a dollar fifty, forty cents, eighty seven cents, a dollar. So let's just say you're paying more and you're paying a dollar. A dollar for this card. Are you saying that? that in the future this couldn't be mm, at minimum a five dollar card so you'd be five xing your money that's all i'm saying guys these these trainer galleries are undervalued people are going to want to complete master sets people are going to want to complete psa 10 sets so there's going to be a market i can't th this card i cannot find this card in a psa 10 on ebay okay it's not it's not there so people but you guys gotta understand people are going to want to complete these sets in tens and raw like this is a card worth picking up now let's just jump back real quick to the overall um and let's take a look at a couple more here um the mile ma isle ma mile ma i don't know how you pronounce this not the coolest pokemon but i do really like this artwork um yeah this one's this one's great three bucks you know i don't know how much more room this one has in particular but i did want to point it out also, a uh, yellow border, but breaks in uh, at 90 cents. Like a starter. Come on, guys. Like, this has room to run. Okay? And then let's even get on to... Um, let's see, I didn't miss anything else here. Okay, let's get on to page two here. Now, there was a few on here. Okay, so I want to talk about... Jinx, not that popular of a Pokemon, but Gen 1. Cool artwork, right? 50 cents, 60, 70 cents. Okay? You tell me this couldn't be a, a $2 card, $3 card, then you're you're having big gains. Okay? I, I could see it being higher as well, but I'm trying to be maybe a little bit realistic. Also, uh, Rock Ralph featured in the new anime, so some potential there. Super cute, sleeping. Like 50 cents? 50 cents? Come on, guys. Like, these cards have room. That's what I'm saying. Um, the smear goal, same thing. Like, even, like, what's the cheapest one in here? So, Malamar. Okay. Eh. You know, not still a cool-looking card, though. Personally, I wouldn't be picking this up. I'd, I'd be picking up some of the other ones. Um, and then, this one right here. Like, really great artwork. Okay. I mean, 55, 70 cents, 60 cents. This this one has a little bit of room just because it's cool. Also, you got to remember, once again, people will be wanting to complete sets, master sets, PSA 10 sets, trainer gallery sets. Um, and then while we're here, let's talk about some of these bigger cards. Obviously, the, the Rayquaza is already up to 48. This Blaziken's taken off. Uh, and rightfully so, and this one's not too far behind. I think that this one is still underrated. Um, Superior, obviously, same thing. Starter Pokemon Evolution, as you can see, it's taken off quite a bit. But I think that there is room with this artwork with the the uh, volcano in the back, or the looks like a volcano, right? And this whole thing, this is a great, this is a great looking card. Uh, this card was higher before. So, uh, I think that this card still has room as well. So, um, yeah, that is going to do it for this one, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, I uh, just, just did a little deep dive on the uh, old trainer gallery there. Just been going, and going through each trainer gallery, kind of working my way around. Really touching on those cards that people are overlooking. So, if you enjoyed this content and you made it this far in the video and you're not already subscribed, obviously you enjoyed it. Hit that subscribe button. Let me know in the comments uh, what your favorite card from this set is. And uh, that's going to do it for this one. I'll catch you guys in the next one. And remember, 
It was never a phase.